Hello, good day, everyone. I want to thank everyone of you that have taken time to watch out our video. Today, we're talking about something very interesting and something very helpful, especially to Nigerians. Those of us that are mostly using the prepaid meters. Okay, it's very important that there's a global upgrade that I think every one of us needs to be aware of this upgrade. Okay, now this upgrade has to affect every distribution, everybody using prepaid meter. So whether you fall under um, Ikeja Electric or you fall under Echo Electric or Ibadan. So I'll be measuring on three distribution, which is Echo, Lagos and uh, Ibadan. Okay, so as you can see on your screen, um, the upgrade from your prepaid meters to a standard transfer specification, that is STS. So, so you must upgrade your prepaid meter before on the, from on the 1st of november to 24th of november it's very very paramount if by 24th of november you you have not upgraded your, your prepaid then you will no longer use that prepaid again so you have to get another prepaid that has come with a new software upgrade so if you find this video helpful please share it subscribe so that other people can benefit from this video that you're benefiting from okay we are going to dive into this lecture right away first of all as you can see on my screen it's an upgrade for a prepaid meter to standard transfer specifications this is sts so this is what we are upgrading from you are, every user of prepaid meter will be upgrading to sts version okay so so what we're measuring on, on this particular video um presentation is Ikeja, which is the IKDC, and Echo, which is the EKEDC, and a Badon, which is EBEC. Okay, these are our three major focus, and we will see the process from using the prepaid, the links, how to do the prepaid, and what and what is required on each of this particular distribution. So that is what we'll be focusing on today. Then I also want to take my time to, I must have downloaded the things from their, um, their official handle. So I'm going to read through. See the EKDC STS prepaid meter upgrade. It said the current software for all prepaid electric meter in the world, including Nigeria, will expire on the 24th of November, 2024. This is called a TID rollover. All STS prepaid meter within Ikeja electric network must be upgraded, otherwise the meter will be unable to load energy token from on the 1st of November 2023 when Ikeja Electric kicks off the T rollover process. It's a, most importantly, all Ikeja Electric customers with STC meter are required to provide their NIM details to prior to this upgrade. Your prepaid meter is STS if 20 digits number are generated when you buy electricity. So for Ikeja Electric, what you need is your NIN as part of the requirements. For those under Ikeja Electric, your NIN, your phone number, and your meter number. Okay, that's what those for uh, Ikeja Electric. Then let's go to, at least for Echo Electric. So Echo Electric is also saying, is your meter eligible for an ST2 upgrade? Now to check if your meter is to be upgraded for ST2 version, Kindly visit our website as ekddp.com slash sts. Okay, impute your current meter number with details and submit. If your meter is eligible, we'll get back to you. But if it's not eligible, you have to reply, you have to apply for a new meter. Do note that the echo distribution will reimburse you for all costs of the meter over time. Kindly follow up the link provided to apply for a new meter so this one's also gotten from their handle too so i think for Italian electric i don't i'm not sure but the meter number and phone number i think is very very important so but i will also guide you to uh, ibadan 2 ibadan 2 is also doing the same thing this is from their official handle okay having kct issue for your meter and for example if from the first and you bought a you are buying a a token for uh, to recharge your light and you've not gotten the uh, kc2 and kc1 all they are saying is to just go through this link and um 
which I will share the link with him for you below in the next slide. You go through the link and once you, they, they, I think this is very, very interactive. Their link is very, very interactive. So just interact with the link and um, your, your KC2 will be given to you. What is KC2? Okay, I'll also let you know what that means, KCT. And the next one is upgrade requirements. So for any upgrade, what we expect you, what I expect you to have is your NIN, your meter number, your phone number, and email for all the distribution. All might not require all the same as requirement, but basically these are all the things that you need for an upgrade to so get them set before you start doing an upgrade from the first of November 2023. Okay. Now, links to visit for the upgrade. Now, for Ikeja Electric, you have to visit uh, smartcaseyc.ikejaelectric.com. This is for Ikeja. The eco distribution is ekdp.com slash sts. Then for Ibadon, imole.ibekdc.com. Okay, so Imoled, sorry, imoled.ibetc.com. Okay, uh, I think I've visited this Imoled. Um, is for if you are having issues from the first and you bought a token and the token didn't give you your KCT token, so you can use this Imoled to generate your KCT token. Okay, so that's what this. So these are the links that you are expected to visit for any of the distribution that you belong to. Now, what to expect from November 1st, 2023. Now, what you expect, you expect three set of tokens. Okay, the first two tokens are called KCT1 and KCT2. So from on the first, once you are buying an energy from on the first, a 320 digit number will be given to you in three places. Okay, so the first 20 is called KCT1. Okay, KCT1. Then that put in that first 20, it will reset your device. Then you put in another thing in second 20 digits, it will upgrade you to STS. Then the third 20 digits, it's now the energy that you buy. This will happen from on the 1st of November 20. 23 for those that have upgraded before for ikeja electric you can't be upgraded until you link your nim so take note about that for ikeja electric for ikeja electric you can't be upgraded until you link your nim okay so make sure you link your nim uh, i can't say for um, the other distribution but for ikeja electric you must link your nim to your meter number before the upgrade can be possible okay so that is that for what to expect from november 1st 2023 thank you if you find this video helpful please subscribe share put on the notification bell share it for friends and family that are using prepaid depending on the distribution like keja echo electric or pardon please not all link to do this upgrade both for keja echo and pardon I found on the description below. Thank you.